Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to episode two of Meet Mercedes Digital, a new communication format delivering product and business news in an all digital format. Here with me today is head of global product and technology communication for Mercedes Benz cars. Welcome, Kurt Grinneveld. Thank you very much. Kurt, how are you doing today? Actually, quite well. I'm glad to hear that. Tell us, what is this episode going to be all about? Today, the whole episode is about a new E Class. Mm -hmm. The whole family gets a new update in 2020, a huge update. And early this year already, we launched the uh, E-Class sedan, the wagon, and the all-terrain. And now the sun is coming out again, the weather is getting, becoming be more beautiful. So it's time to get two new family members out there as well. Mm -hmm. And I'm talking about the new Mercedes-Benz and Mercedes-AMG Coupe and Cabriolet. Wonderful. So those are the two that we are seeing on the road today, right, Kurt? Exactly. And a good point. Um, we thought those cars are so nice. They need to be driven outside. So we don't show them here in the studio, mm -hmm. but we took them outside in Nimmendingen. And uh, we have colleagues to mention all the details there because mm -hmm. it's a lot to talk about. It's not only beauty there. It's mm -hmm. a lot of innovation where the E-Class traditionally stands for. And now we are very eager to see some of those pictures. So why don't we get straight to it? Ladies and gentlemen, here they come. Let's check out the new E-Class Cabriolet and E53 4Matic Plus Coupe. Hi, my name is Andrea Ruland and I'm the product manager of the E-Class Cabriolet and Coupe. And I'm Camelia Brotner and I'm responsible for the product management at AMG. And today we are here to tell you a little about some of the most emotional cars of the E-Class family. Specifically, the E-Class Cabriolet and the E53 Formatic Plus from Mercedes-AMG. Both stand for absolute driving pleasure with the looks to match. So, what are we waiting for? Now you're talking, Camelia. Let's take them for a spin. in the new E-Glass Cabriolet. Definitely one of the most comfortable Cabriolets on the market right now. With its top down, it's as comfortable as it is closed, especially if you have the air cap feature. But it doesn't have to be quiet and calm if you don't want it to be. Just put down your foot and feel the kick of the EQ Boost that puts you back in your seat. This Mercedes has a four-cylinder diesel engine with integrated starter generator, so-called ISG. This means pure driving pleasure and efficiency. All E-Class models have the new capacitive steering wheel. It looks super stylish, but most importantly, it has seamless control surfaces and a two-zone sensor mat inside for the first time. This enables semi-autonomous driving functions. has also the EQ Boost and that means that the electric auxiliary compressor is supported by the ISG, the Integrated Starter Generator, which builds up a really high pressure without any delay. And the outcome is a faster increase in torque for acceleration. And you can see that also in the facts. From 0 to 100 in 4.4 seconds.
When it comes to the infotainment system, the E-Class model comes with the latest AMBI-UX system. So you can switch between different display styles and also adjust AMD specific display settings. When it comes to the steering wheel, we have our AMG specific steering wheel buttons where you can also make some driving settings. So for example, you can switch the different driving features with our AMG Dynamic Select or the AMG Dynamics. If you want to have a more spirited drive today, what are you looking for? High agility, neutral cornering behavior and optimum traction. Good news! We have the AMG SpeedShift TCT 9G transmission on board and together with our AMG Ride Control Plus and our Formatic Plus all-wheel drive system, a dynamic ride is guaranteed. And if you now want to go a step further, you can choose our AMG Dynamic Plus package which is available for the first time in an AMG E-Class Coupe. With it, you get the race driving program and the drift mode. Wow, impressive! What can we tell more about our dream cars? I think that says it all and the E-Class family speak for itself while driving or even parked. With you behind the wheel it shouts out loud. So, which one shall we try next? Well, I think I know which one. All right, Kurt, thank you so much for that lovely first impression of the new models and that EQ boost feature. That must come in very handy when it comes to passing lanes, right? Well, actually, it doesn't only sound nice. <laughs> uh, the EQ boost fu function actually is a major part in our electrification strategy. Give me a refresher on that, please. Yeah, uh, I'm talking about three lanes. The first lane is this 48 volt system with EQ Boost. Mm -hmm. uh, we combine it with the combustion engines and it's actually a major increase in fuel efficiency for the vehicles. What about the other two lanes yeah. of the three? The other two ones are the EQ Power. I'm mm -hmm. talking about the plug-in hybrids. Uh, I'm talking about a whole range of A-Class to until GLE with increasing ranges of electric uh, yeah, range. And the GLE, you're already talking about 100 kilometers. Mm -hmm. so very important part, a very major uh, lane in our strategy. But the third one actually is the EQ, the EQ models, the battery electric vehicles. We have the EQC already on the market, the smart EQs. We have the EQV coming up in a couple of weeks. And last not least, the EQA, EQB, EQS. Mm -hmm. So many more models up front in the next months and years. That's very exciting. So many more to come. Thank you so much for that inside, Kurt. But ladies and gentlemen, that's all the time we do have for today. I look forward to seeing you next time. And Kurt, thank you once more for your time. Thank you very thank much. Thank you so much. Bye.